This is a demonstration video of the Fidelity record player. I'm just going to show you how to use it so that you'll be familiar with it when you receive it. The first thing that you'll need to do is to screw down the two transit screws on the record deck located here and here and screw those both down fully clockwise so that the deck floats on its springs. On the front the two main controls on off volume at the top and tone at the bottom. Speed dial is on the left and the start stop dial on the right. So you can stack between one and six records. I'm going to demonstrate with two just so that you can see how it plays. So just pop the records onto the spindle ledge and put the stacker arm across. Select the speed and then to start the auto changer just flip the right hand control knob all the way around. And if you want to skip to the next record, just flick the right hand control knob all the way around again. So I'll just demonstrate with the start of a 12 inch record as well. When you stack a 10 or 12 inch record, the black horizontal lever here is the size selector arm. So you need to make sure that the record is stacked above the black lever like that. And that's so that the playing arm knows to land in the correct position. And of course the arm lifts off automatically at the end of the record. If you don't want to use the auto changer and you just want to play one record manually at a time, then you can just pop a record down the spindle onto the mat and just select the first option which says on manual and that will start the turntable turning and you can then place the arm onto the record yourself. Once the arm is on the record and it's playing, carefully lower the stacker arm down so that it knows to switch off automatically at the end of play. If you leave it playing with the stacker bar in the upright position as shown here, that will trigger the repeat function which is for 7 inch records only and it will play the same 7 inch record over again until manually switched off. So I hope that covers everything but of course if you do have any questions when you receive it, please send me a message.